Hey there, what's up YouTube? I'm Extraordinary Jr. and welcome to episode 19 of Pokemon Glazed. In the last episode, we, uh, how do I say this nicely? Got fucking annihilated. Robbed. By the gym leader. And we actually hit, after failing so badly, I had to pick up not one, but two people to actually help us out. And the way we're going to explain this is very difficult, so... Can we superimpose this on the video? Oh my god. <laughs> Can we? Yes. Alright, so send that to me and then... Alright, so... No more smoke, you understand? Do you guys want to introduce yourselves? What are your names? Uh, what's up, I'm Patrick. I'm David's roommate. I sleep two beds down from him. Occasionally in his bed. You know, we don't... And I'm also Patrick. I sleep a few doors down. Never in anyone else's bed. In this room. I, I don't know how we're going to address this. Just go <laughs> Pat 1 and Pat... Just somehow we're going to tell the difference between them. Uh, David's roommate will be Pimo. Yeah. And down the hall, I will be just Patrick, Pat, whichever. Yeah, so they're going to be joining us for the next few episodes. Uh, we need a new recording buddy anyway. And they're literally just on Snapchat fucking around, which is fine. <laughs> uh, because more people is usually more fun. So much fun. It is. We're a huge contributors here. Yeah, right? <laughs> Obviously. Uh, one thing I should have gone over is that after we failed miserably, uh, we had to train a lot. <laughs> so, uh, team's better. Team's a lot better now. A lot more evolutions. Train. All that fun shit. Train. Alright. Trained, quote unquote, because I had to use the rare candies because the game crashed yeah. after an hour of yeah. training. So I had to use rare candies to get back all that time. There's only so much time. It's, so much time. You got Come on. Not enough time. You, got, you gotta give me credit, though. At least I... No, you, yeah. made, you made me admit it. To be fair, I would've just completely lied about that yeah, one. So you called yeah. me out. It's okay. He tried. I, I did try, at least, but I got caught. Please understand, he tried very hard, but in the end, it was he all for naught. <laughs> Perfect Lincoln Park reference. Oh, God, I love Lincoln Park. They're so fucking good. Should have bet on that one, Pima. I don't listen to Lincoln Park that much. Yeah, well. Eh, you know, it's time from time to time. Anyway, we should, at least I'll focus on what we're doing right now. We're fighting the leader, Flo, which, you're, which they're both going to have to worry about eventually. Cause from they're, Progressive? God, nah, fucking. Oh. Oh, I God damn it! I like how this battle's going so far, though. I'm not at this gym yet. Yeah. Yeah, both, uh, Sorry both Pats, Pimo and pa and Patrick, ah. are playing Pokemon Glazed. I I told them about the game, and they're one badge in each. I believe I'm one badge. I'm in. not a badge yet. My game didn't save, so I had to restart completely. And oh, I'm, you have to I'm use like you have to use save states on the game. That's how it works. Save what? Save states. Oh, uh, I'll show it to you file. after. Yeah. I think it's shit. Oh. Oh. Yeah, there you go, that's why. I believe it's shipped F1. I, I, I don't know, I just set it up like I, I tried that once and I didn't save my files, so... I'm a dipshit. Just yeah. go through the motion. Alright, so now, you guys weren't aware of this, but this Melodic, the one that we're facing right now, twice killed the entire team without even taking any damage. Yo, Melodics are so fucking strong. They are. I struggle with them in every single game. Every game. No, Ruby and Sapphire, I just got oh, absolutely yeah. wrecked. Emerald. Yeah. Every <laughs> single collective. Who was it, Steven who had it? Yeah, uh, yeah. Game, I believe, right? No, not the fun. No, no there's no, no fun. No, it kidding. was the uh, one you had to go under the water to get into. Yeah, that's yep. uh, that's the eighth one. I know which yeah. one you're talking about, but I forgot the name. She had that, and that absolutely wrecked you. Yeah. Yeah. Every time. I needed every bit of it. Yeah. Every time. So our here, actually, we're talking about, you know, Pokemon in third generation. What do you guys think about the new uh, remakes that are coming out, I think, in November? What do you I don't. Think? I don't really care for them much, cause I mean I have the games still, the originals with all my files, level hundred Blaziken. <laughs> so, uh, but mainly it's just like I understand it's like cool with the graphics and all, and I'd definitely be down to like check it out. But I'm not gonna go out running to buy it and spend another like sixty bucks on a game I have. Yeah, I mean I understand that too. Uh, personally, I'm very excited for it because. Uh, Emerald was actually my favorite Pokemon game growing up, yeah, and yeah. even even mm. today still. It's true. It's true. And um, you know, I, I'd love to see like what they did ten years later, mm -hmm. and seeing all the new stuff they added. <laughs> It'd be pretty cool. I got a I have a 3DS. I've like I beat Y in like a week. I just was just not like getting away from it. Just stuck to it. It was so much fun. I, I really did enjoy Pokemon X and Y. I played it twice. One time I actually did it for YouTube once, uh, and then I played a second time for myself. Uh, they really did a great job with that game. It really was yeah, so was, much more fun. It really I never got to play it. it. It's you don't. Do you have a 3DS or no? No, I have a regular DS. Ah, uh, there you go. I struggle. Yeah. Uh -huh. 
I, uh, my 3DS, the, the touchscreen cracked like internally because it was used, and like after a week of using it, it just like spiderweb like middle of me using it. That's and I was in the middle of like trying to wonder trade, and oh, just, I can't I can't wonder trade. It's just broken like around how I get to it, and I didn't spend enough time to see if I can get to it through buttons. That's rough. And most likely is what. Anyway, as we were talking about 3DSs uh, and you know new games, we actually defeated the gym leader, uh, which is nice because now we have three badges in this game. And from what I've heard. <laughs> a silly little thotty. Look at her. She's throwing, showing so much skin down. <laughs> oh my god. From what I've heard, this game gets incredibly difficult very quickly, though, so. Really? Good From bet. what I've heard. It's always good. I get annoyed when I just jump through the gyms. Like, I don't spend any time on it. And just... Yeah. And yeah. your Pokemon are weak, and then you get to the Elite Four, and you get right! <laughs> you just, there's no way around it. That's all that happens, really. You just lose money. Time after time. Oh god, don't even don't even talk about losing money. I've probably died in this game, like completely Pokemon dead six times. And that's really, really fucking pathetic. <laughs> that I have to even admit that and the fact that it is true. Like I'm not even kidding. Six or seven times my entire team has fainted in this game already. Yeah, it's already gotten to me a few times, I'm not gonna lie. No, I mean I'm a I wasn't prepared. Yeah, you know what? It's uh it's a really fun game though. Like that's the reason why I now like doing the Pokemon ROM hacks is because, uh, like you know, the normal games are very, um, what's the right word? I guess predictable. You know? Yeah, it's just it's like you just go through motions. There's yeah, that's like, exactly no it. It's very way. formulaic. Like you can tell, like after like the fifth or sixth gym, you're gonna have to fight the bad guys, the criminal like group, and then everything. it's like it's like it's. Not the same. No, I, I know what you're trying to say. I, I know what you meant by that. Uh, because it is very formulated, and you really do always have, like, right before the 8th badge, you have to fight the Team Rocket or the Team, yeah. team Magma. Team Magma team. team uh, yeah, right before, like, the 8th badge, and then it is very predictable, and that is one of the things I don't like about Pokemon, but, you know, that's why I like the ROM hacks now. They're usually very different. I mean, they kind of follow the same formula, but it's... At least different enough that it's more fun. Yeah, there's things thrown in that yeah. just, you know, you wouldn't expect normally. That's exact. Yeah, exactly. And I don't know. I mean, they're different. I don't. I like not knowing entirely uh, what to do every single time. You know, because I've played enough of the Pokemon games where it's, oh, get the starter, yeah. get the Pidgey of the game, win. <laughs> yeah. It's very very simple, pretty much. These yeah. things, I, I don't know. I, half the time I'm lost in the ROM hacks too. I'm just I'm I run in circles for hours talking to everyone. Just yeah. Hey, it's like, oh, yo, what's up? <laughs> I realize that a lot of these ROM hacks also just people that talk to you just like, oh, here, have a Pokemon, super rare. Like, what? Yeah, that's like, actually... Why would you do that? That's happened. Uh, I don't think in this... Was it this game? Yeah, no, in this game you get a, a Ditto for free, which I guess Ditto's okay. Well, they did that in one of the... In Leaf Green, I think, they give you a Ditto uh, egg or uh, something. Yeah, they, 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 like, no, they, yeah. they gave me, like, a... I don't know if it was this one or another... Uh, another hack. I was, it was maybe like Fire Omega or something. Okay, I've never played that one actually. It's on my phone. I have to do something when I can't use the computer in class. Yeah, right. <laughs> but uh, they just gave me like a level 10 Trico, and like later on they gave me like another like level 10 like Growlithe and stuff. So, like, oh, what? it's sick. Like, oh, this there's Growlithe. Game? I'm gonna obviously play it then. I have to. <laughs> Dude, Trico's a beast. Actually, yeah, talking about because Growlithe is my favorite Pokemon. What are your guys' favorite Pokemon actually? We've not, you know, is... touched on that. That's really rough actually. He's like. Growlithe and like that whole evolution with him is like definitely up there. Like just it's a classic. Yeah. I don't I don't know if I could like definitely give you one. That's really rough. Uh there's a lot of like Pokemon. I like Mewtwo. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, I was expecting you like, you know, continue, you said there's a lot of no, Pokemon, so my favorite Pokemon is either between Skeptile. Okay. okay. Or Blaziken. Okay, so those are my boys. No, nah, those those are good too, actually. Uh, those are my boys. You can actually hate me for saying this, but my favorite starter is Swamp is Mudkip. Uh, I fucking uh, hate Trico, and I and I really don't like Torchic. Trico is like with Trico, it's you're in for the long haul. Like when he's like a lower level, he's kind of like weak. Then when you get to Grovile, he can kick some ass. But when you're Skeptile, he destroys. Yeah. Blaziken, Blaziken just kicks all the way through. Blazichin, Blazik, Blazichin. <laughs> Blazichin. <laughs> He's pretty well-rounded, yeah. Oh, yeah, I agree with you. I like Mudkip, too. I'm not yeah. gonna lie. I like the fact that he has, like, Trico one weakness. Trico is probably my least favorite of those three. Yeah, I Trico, I never, I never could get into it. Usually kind of sucked, so. Nah, yeah, whatever. Who cares? 
It's all opinion. One of my, like, one I always loved, like, is just Cyndaquil. Oh, okay. Oh, oh yeah, come on. there you go. Cyndaquil is always... Like Typhlosion in the end, he just he's like underrated, man. She says she hates this band. Oh god. For everyone wondering, Pimo's girlfriend uh, hates Pimo's headband that he's wearing right now, and I would take a picture, but I don't know my phone. It's in my pocket. Uh, it's a pretty sweet headband. Got I gotta admit, man. I will superimpose this picture if I remember to. Like I've I've made like a ton of like little like jokes that. Oh god, no, Patrick, you're beautiful. Or Pimo, you're beautiful. There you go, I got it. I will eventually have to go back and actually edit. <laughs> not, not saying that I don't edit, but yeah, I always forget yeah. to do stuff, yeah. and it's so bad. Like, I'm going to forget, like, the first thing you said, too, in the beginning of the video. Oh, I know I'm going to. <laughs> yeah, so... Right now, we're, we're, like, just walking around, like, battling people. Yeah, we're, we're just being little kids up. I mean, that's that's obviously the dream, right? We're, pretty sweet. We're, we are literally living the dream. Like, this is what people, like, will spend their lives trying to do. And we're just better than them. It's, it's pretty, it's pretty cool. <laughs> oh god, I don't know. Don't the volume is gonna be deafening. I do like. not put on the TV. Oh my god. Oh, good call. Good call. Why don't you put on the TV anyway? Oh, you're gonna play Xbox? Yeah. <laughs> you're gonna what literally multitask, bro? Come on. Multitask. Alright, so we're gonna lose Pimo real fast. Oh, uh, no, we already lost Zero him. To he, he's gonna play fucking FIFA. You're gonna be playing Zero this. Zero to 100. You're gonna be playing this for the next like three episodes. Zero to 100. God damn it. Alright. <laughs> nah, I'll still be in it, don't worry. Well, you'll be here in spirit then. Because you're literally next to us, so it's not uh, like, you know. It's not your. Uh, <laughs> you're like not going far. Oh, God. What have we got ourselves into? Overall <laughs> favorite type, I'm curious. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna take it either. Uh, fairy! I love the fairy oh, type. Oh, so Actually, cool. that, oh you're God. close with fire, because fire definitely is one of my favorite, but I think it's between fire and electric. Oh, alright. Which I is, uh. Yeah, no, because Growlithe is my favorite, and I do love all the fire types. But you really can't go wrong with electric. You know, they're all pretty good. Pretty well, you much gets everything. Yeah, what about you, Patrick? What do you think? Steel, because Ooh. they're so metal. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. No, but seriously, up there. Steel's actually one of my favorite types. Like, um, oh, that Skarmory, uh, yeah. Steelix. They're just beasts. They are. They're filthy animals. I mean, they are literally animals, but yeah. They're filthy, though. So, can you wash them? Can you, can you like, fix that or no? I mean, like, yeah, you just get. You gotta be super you get, careful with that water on them. Though. You get steel polish. Oh god, alright, well. Oh, uh, looks like we have to fucking use Rock Smash. Alright, well, we're going to end it off here. Uh, mostly because, well, this is a convenient ending. So next time, we'll go use Rock Smash, if we have it, I think we do. Go into this tunnel, probably go through some cave. Uh, Pimo, Patrick, do you have anything you want to say before we end off? No. Oh, well. Thanks for having me. Yeah, well. Good time, you'll, good time. Well, you'll be here for the next few episodes anyway, so uh, yep. we'll see you guys next time. Alright, see you boys. See you guys.